Hello everyone. So today we will be learning about FTK Disk Imaging tool. So we will go step by step. So first thing we need for any imaging tool is evidence. So I will be using one pen drive and I will create disk images of a disk image of that pen drive. So uh, I will show you how to do it. Just go to your PC and just attach your pen drive, right? So this is my pen drive. It's uh, it's sus drive. Let's say suspects drive. Okay. Now here there are some files, right? Uh, there might be a case that the victim a uh, suspect has deleted files from his or her storage device. So we will simulate that also. Let's say I I will delete this uh, Usain Bolt's image. I will also delete. Let's say this uh, fort mid image so i will delete both of them uh, i will delete this permanently okay remember this these files won't uh, you won't see those in recycle bin these are permanently deleted for windows okay and this file fine now i will show you also recycle bin in recycle bin these files won't be visible you can see here these uh, those files are not here right the both images are not here these are recent deleted images so you can't see both of them here so both of those images are permanently deleted i will close recycle bin now you can see this is my pen drive now first of all i will go to like installation so basically uh, FTK is managed by FT uh, Access Data Company. They have a lot of uh, renowned tools for forensic. So I will just tell you how to download and install. Just go to their official website. Okay, we are already in, uh, in download page, and you can see other things here. So, uh, I mean, what it can do, what it can't. So now let's go to download page. so basically uh, here you have to mention your first name last name and other thing uh, don't fill dummy data especially don't fill any uh, your email id should be your actual email id okay else you won't get download link because they send download link in your email so your email id should be an accurate one and then you will get uh, one email and you will get that this .exe file means you will be able to uh, download this exe file okay ftk imager and version depends upon when you when you will be doing this lab okay uh, and now i will just install this okay so let me shift this here so now basically uh, just go with all default settings uh, okay fine install launch okay so this is a uh, i will say default window of ftk imager and now remember we have to open our pen drive right that pen drive and usually remember one thing that uh, this is not directly uh, usually we use a hardware device like write blocker so my pen drive won't be actually uh, directly communicating with ftk imager there will be a write blocker to ensure that evidence is not altered so we are not considering that here so we will directly open our pen drive so i will add evidence item uh, physical drives uh, means there are different uh, i will say evidence type you can even create image file so basically it compresses it is like more compressed way or more compressed uh, version of that already existing image file you can even like use in folder as the name suggests you can even uh create a copy of email, uh, folder so i will actually clone whole physical drive 
रिमेम्बर वन थिंग हियर चूज यूर पेन ड्राइव ओके डोंट चूज यूर एक्चुअल हार्ड डिस्क और एस एस डिस आई विल चूज माई पेन ड्राइव एंड फिनिश एंड नाउ यू विल सी वॉट्स एक्चुअली इन साइड पेन ड्राइव ऑफ दैट सस्पेक्ट लेट्स गो टू रूट एंड हियर यू कैन सी दीज आर द फाइल विच आर प्रेजेंट इन पेन ड्राइव एंड यू कैन सी हियर दैट एक्चुअली वी डिलीटेड बोथ ऑफ दोज फाइल परमानेंटली राइट विंडोज वॉज नॉट एबल टू रिकवर दैट बट यू कैन सी हियर दैट I can an FTK is able to like find out this already deleted files and even you can export these files to any your like Windows directory, right? So you can recover the deleted files. So this is actually how you open any evidence file. Now let's say I want to create disk image of this, or I will say I want to image raw image, right? Or evidence. So what I can do is basically I will go to file and I will go to create disk image right oh, on so again I will choose physical drive next uh, again choose your uh, pen drive finish uh, okay fine image source is fine if you want see here it's already checked that verify images after they are creating so basically it uh, checks the hash values and compare the images and you can here create directory listing of all files and i will say yes i will click on that because my pen drive is of around 8 gb and there are not too much directories but if you are doing on actual hard disk or ssd right so there are a lot of lot of this i will say directories right so means if you are doing that for demo then i will say don't click on that because you have already lot it will take time right so in my case it won't take too much time and you have to uh, add the destination and choose the image type so we will be using a raw format basically it's a bit by image format and uncompressed image format and these are other actually proprietary disk image formats so i will go with raw because it is compatible with a, a each and every forensic product related to imaging next uh, case number so basically you have to enter right regarding case let's say ftk01 uh ftk01 uh, it's a evidence number okay so again zero, uh, it's the first evidence for this case mm. Pen drive of X NSA employee. Let's say examiner. Let's say John Cena is a forensic investigator here. You can add anything. I won't add notes. Let's go to next. Uh, I will. I will store the image file on my desktop. So on desktop, file, file name. So I will say PD image. I, obviously, basically in real scenario, your names actually contain date and other things usually. But here in demo, I won't uh, do that. So PD image is fine. And we don't have to write extension, so don't write dot dd here. Okay, fine, and everything looks cool. Okay, start. So it has started creating image of our pen drive. Okay, and it will be stored on desktop with the name pd image dot dd. So ftk has created image file, and you can see here the uh. A summary i will say of, of images and the hashes and hash value whether they match or not so you can see here match 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 so no so no bad block found in image so basically our evidence is authentic right now i will close this uh, it i will close this fine so ftk has created evidence on desktop 
so before checking that i will remove the current evidence so just like right click on the uh, my pen drive or your evidence item and just remove that and then i will close ftk and you can see on desktop it has created image files and it has also created the directory listing so these are all image files and i will open the directory listing so let me show you the full name okay so here you can see the name of my image files right and there were two videos so basically it has given the name and here you will see the directory right so where they are stored in that image the location of these files is listed up here and the size and date modified so is deleted option is also there so you can see we deleted right two files right so here you can see yes and yes and it is in front of usain bolt and fort made image so it has correctly detected even deleted deleted files and so this is uh, all about ftk and ftk imaging tool so basically we created we basically i will say we first created one sample evidence in our pen drive we deleted two files so permanently we deleted those files permanently then we installed uh, ftk imager we opened our pen drive in that then we just saw deleted files also then we created evidence image file dot dd files and you can see these files here and we also create we also got the directory listing right so basically directory listing aids you in knowing the structure of the storage and how i mean logical storage allocation and the directory is created you know, a directory present in that suspect storage drive so this was all about ftk so do like and subscribe thank you